Uh, yeah, then going into the main card, we had a little a little two piece first fight, Xander Zayas. He is of, like really good. Jesus. A, lot, a lot of similarities between uh, Xander and Keyshawn in terms of their mental approach to a fight yeah. and their energy, uh, 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 their the, the way that they use their energy in in terms of uh, approaching the fight, um, and not to stay on Keyshawn at all, but. Uh, obviously, we're excited to see him, but moving into Xander, I'm I got nothing but like just the the best things that that you could say about yeah. someone. I don't have anything less than that to say about Xander. First time I've seen him in person, mm -hmm. and damn, his hands are fast. Yeah, <laughs> I knew he was powerful, but in person, his hands are flying. And he had a great opponent. He had to he had yeah. to get that guy out of there. Yeah. That guy wasn't going nowhere. He was Xander, like Sean said, he he checked every box. Check body work was great. Speed was good. Power was good. Um, hey, defense, maybe, if anything, if you're going to nitpick something, maybe mm -hmm. his defense. But, took a little too many yeah, shots. Yeah, but, you know, you're going to have that. But I, I get what you're saying. And, and I think, you know, American boxing purists would note, would maybe note that, right? Mm -hmm. But the thing is, the, the manner in which he fought is so perfect and endearing for his fan base. Mm -hmm. Those Puerto Rican mm -hmm. fans that are dying on a Trinidad or a Cotto, mm -hmm. they yeah. don't mind you getting touched up a little bit hit a little bit, welted up a little bit if you're going for it. If you're in there, yeah. throwing the left hook, bringing ass to get ass, that's what's going to endear him. That I, I guarantee you, they loved the way he fought last yeah, that night. That crowd and, was going buck wild for him. Too. <laughs> right. Because he was, I was going buck wild for him. He was, he was lighting his, lighting him up. He had, I think was it his fight where I, I had a, I don't know, I said, Jesus. Yeah, yeah, I was like, he hit him, I was he like, hit him hey. with, he hit him with like a one, two, two in the corner. And hey. I said, Jesus. Yeah, Carson was wild and almost threw his panties on stage. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah, yeah he, <laughs> was wild, he is, he's the real deal. And and fun fact, he's only 19. <laughs> yeah. And I th what did he yell after? Um, obviously we was there, yeah, but I, I think could, he yelled like, I'm the best puncher in Yeah, I don't know what, he was fired up though. But yeah, he's only yeah. 19 years only old. 19. That's, that's scary. That's unbelievable. That's scary. Because he signed. It was he the youngest ever yeah. for top rank? Yeah. Mm. And so we've seen him now on TV, on these yeah. fights, undercards, you know, kind of moving up. Now he's the co-main yesterday. And I was wow. like, what's his record? Holy man? shit. 14 and 0, 10 knockouts. So yeah. every, he's moving. And yeah. he's, moving. he's got that that punch. He's got the left hook that Cotto and Trinidad had. That's yeah. that's the famous shot. And yeah, he's he Offensive arsenal is unlimited. And he <laughs> wasn't in there with a bomb last night. No, one. not at all. So he's showing no, you. No, he had I never been compete. stopped. That guy? He had never been stopped in 28 Dang. fights. Yeah. 24 and 4. Had never been dropped. And Xander took him out of there. He, that guy yeah. was not an a, A-level fighter. He was like a B-minus fighter, but had sturdy. And, and knew how to utilize yeah. him. You put guys in the ring with a young 19-year-old that is one-handed. Really strong, but just one-handed. Yeah, it's, it's like there's always a handicap. Last night, there was no handicap. But po it's just Xander was faster. Yeah. Sharper. Stronger. And like you said, going back to if there was any knock, Xander was getting hit like in in, in the gambling. midst of throwing his shots. Yeah. He was and it's like I was watching the fight just trying to figure out like, okay, this is this is great. But where how can I give him something to improve not getting hit once once one, one, in that like as he's releasing and his punches landed first and last. Yeah. But the fact that he was just getting he got lumped up and I was like, damn, like he's gotta protect himself a little bit more. Because a guy who is an A level guy or a B or a mid B guy that is just as fast or whatever, then there could be some problems, some issues, you know. Yeah, so right. But until we get there, I, and again, once we get there, I don't have any any doubt that he'll be ready. With him? I spar with him. How is how is he in the ring? I promise this is a true story. We sparred. I didn't know who he was at all, and they were telling me up and coming guy. Da 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 da. da. I think he might have been. Uh, maybe seven and zero at the time when we sparred, give or take. And I remember, think not, like realizing, like this kid's good. Yeah, I'm two steps ahead of him, but he's thinking. Yeah, like, he's he's good. And I remember it was fun. He did some moves, and I was like, oh, that was amateur, but but he was good. Like yeah. in the fact that he's thinking and he's trying stuff. You know, what I mean, he's this is a kid that we are going to see. Literally, we're gonna see him grow in the sport of boxing, and I believe that he is on the right track where he's having the right experiences in the ring, mm -hmm. and then outside of the ring, he's taking care of everything so that he's 100%. Really, really likable as well. Yeah. Great interview. Yeah. He, I, I won't forget yeah, that electric. about sparring him. I remember like just seeing his eyes and seeing him think, and I was I was a step, maybe a step ahead, ahead of him, a step and a half ahead of him, but I would just remember thinking like, he's good. 
Yeah. Like, give, give it some time. And some of the stuff he missed today, Yeah, if I'm not gone, like, I'm going to get hit. The next time. <laughs> yeah, 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 next time. We get hit with some of this stuff, you know? So he he's really good. Really talented boxer. He's the next one at 154? Yes. Yeah. yeah. Got to get Charlo out of there first. Yeah. I think. I don't by, think they'll line up. Yeah, I think no, by no, the time no, he gets no, there, Charlo will be gone. Uh, um, did he get a belt last night? A regional, regional, regional title. Yeah. <laughs> They're yeah. killing me. They need them. The no, 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 no. You need, you need the regional titles. You need the regional titles. Oh, okay. You, you know you know what's going on? Not again. Don't do this again. They're not calling it a world title. You know, it's, yeah, yeah. It's, yeah it's, but no, they're, are, you they're, trying to know, are you trying to know it, Sean? No, there was, an, there was another episode where we're, we're trying to connect the dots. Well, if you get NABF <laughs> and then you put a, a draw two on it, then all of a sudden you're WBO <laughs> mandatory. And it's like that was this a, crazy. That was a and WBO. I was like, please, guys, <laughs> That was a WBO was, yesterday, right? Was, no, it was no, NA, no, NABF, <laughs> maybe. And that, oh, that gets you the NAI. That gets you the D. That gets you the NBA what W. NBA W. I don't know. So what is he now? Is he ranked top 15 now or top 10? Yeah, I believe so. Top 15. But, you know, even if he even if he never becomes – the, the greatest defensive fighter. They're great fighters like Trinidad and Cotto were these great vulnerable fighters. Like Trinidad went down in the first half of almost all his title fights. He went down in six or seven fights, would get up, knock the he other said, guy first down. first one's on the house. Right, right. <laughs> you, I'm going to give you that one. Yeah. That's it. And then Cotto get wobbled around. Yeah. Bloody. Yeah. Pull it out. Yeah. Yeah. And, you know, so it's it's exciting. He, yeah. I, I definitely think he's that next guy. And like Keyshawn, they both have that guy next door personality like you could introduce them to your parents and and then but that but then punish you in the ring yeah could be mean and punish you in the ring wanted to speak to that real quick because that was like the really the the thing that i feel is where they're the most similar where they outside of the ring they're having fun Mm -hmm. and even once they get in the ring you see xander's going back and forth and my thoughts were uh what is that energy uh it reserved that energy uh you're having fun uh, a little too much. Go, no, go ahead and do it. <laughs> yeah. You know, some guys know how to enjoy that moment. And then when that first bell ring, rung, rings, because that's how I was. I couldn't wait for that first bell. When that bell rings, it's just all about the business. You know what I mean? Xander, um, they, they did the face off at the press conference and they did not turn away from one another. That's just his energy. I got to handle this business. But once you get me into the uh, interview uh, atmosphere and then I'm back to having fun, you know, yeah. so. Both those guys have that 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 it factor where they can dazzle the crowd, entertain the crowd, but then be handle the business. Yeah. You know, we Sean, he, like, he won you over in 15, 10 seconds into the fight. He won Sean for Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he was throwing. Well, he heard him yeah. in the first 15. He heard him with, like oh, the first he, shot he, he threw, oh, right? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You thought you was talking to yourself? <laughs> Sean was like, I said that out loud. <laughs> <laughs> this is what I like right here. This is what I like right here. Cause hey, he got busy. Yeah, yeah the bell rings. He yeah. comes out on his jab. He's got a directive. He's got a game plan. Yeah. He is comfortable and confident in what he can do, and he wants to set everything up. You know, he's oh. he wants to take control. And you know, I was all about that. So, ten seconds in, I'm like, yeah, this one I'm talking about. I'm sold. You know? I'm sold. Yeah. <laughs> he's only 19 yeah, years it's crazy. old. And I couldn't believe it. I, I checked like three different times. D- I was double like, checking. Now he's 19, or he was 19 <laughs> three years ago. But. <laughs> right. 